brilliant aeronautical engineer Edgar Schmood headed up the team at North American Aviation, which designed from scratch and flew the prototype P-51 Mustang in just 120 days. The British, for whom the fighter was originally built, quickly found it to be well suited to the roving ground attack mission required in the European theater. When fitted with the Rolls-Royce Merlin engine, the Mustang became the quintessential piston engine fighter. It had the range to escort the bombers deep into Germany, engage the Luftwaffe, then continue its close air support mission all the way home. When the United States entered World War II, Charles McGee was an engineering student at the University of Illinois, enrolled in the ROTC program. Learning of an experiment to recruit black men for a flying squadron at nearby Chanute Field, he filled out a pilot application for the Army Air Corps. He soon found himself training in Tuskegee, Alabama. As he progressed through to active duty, he flew the P-40, P-39, and P-47, before flying a Mustang for the first time, July 1, 1944. His brilliant military career would continue for 30 years with tours of duty in World War II, Korea, and Vietnam. He retired as a colonel in 1973. The bright red tails of the fighters flown by the 332nd Fighter Group were often a source of great comfort to the bomber pilots and crews who saw them alongside their formations. The group squadrons had a reputation for fearless, unwavering protection of the bombers. The commemorative Air Force's Red Tail P-51C restoration features a composite color scheme that honors the men of all four of the group squadrons. The Minnesota wing of the commemorative Air Force completed restoration of its first Red Tail, honoring the Tuskegee Airmen, in 2001. However, in May of 2004, a catastrophic mechanical failure resulted in the loss of that airplane and its project leader and pilot, Don Hins. The squadron immediately committed to undertake a new Red Tail project. With years of grassroots fundraising and untold hours of volunteer sweat equity, the new Mustang took to the skies in 2009. In this historic Warbirds in Review, Tuskegee Airman Colonel Charles McGee along with Doug Rosendahl and Brad Lang of the CAF's Red Tail Squadron, will share firsthand the experiences that connected them to one of the most famous fighting units in the history of the United States Air Force. <laughs>